is okay may 20th uh on victoria's forehand side the main thing is he works on the forehand side not too much emphasis on lifting to the right because she was doing it uh enough we did talk about uh, go ahead put your regular aggressive uh, refocus you aggressive ready position aggressive ready position is the racket is a little bit more out in front right but, uh, always knee bend right and then at the very beginning we worked on uh, hop 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 show me hop 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 all right watch my hand all right go this way and it was this way then go this way all right all right turn this way turn okay well that's not the way i said but that's okay all right so you keep the feet apart go do it bend 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 turn look at my hand turn <laughs> yeah. All right. So we get the idea. You know what to do. Okay. Uh, the forehand side. Lift to the right. We sold her to go ahead. Eliminate the cupping completely. She is able to do that. Um, okay. Uh, the first thing she's supposed to think about when she goes to the forehand side is keep the racket low. Right. Low position one. Um, we we were trying to get rid of this uh, this this flicking 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 that she does it, and we were able to do, uh, get rid of it to a certain point. But there's we have to rebuild her stroke uh, um, from that. Um, so go to one. Go to one, go to two, right? Told her to lock the one piece right here. Make sure you hold that angle right there. The, the side of the elbow, have that go through the stroke more. Go, 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 go. And then as she, when she hits, make sure the legs are bent because she goes cross court. Make sure that hip turns, bend, 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 bend. Oh my goodness. All right? And then the, the actual thing we want to do is overcorrect is for the arm to go across the body like this. This is incorrect, but this is to break this this motion. Try and hold this rack like this, right? Even this with this bend like here. If she doesn't do it, she usually, what we want to try and eliminate is this early break right here that she does, all right? Uh, it's good to have it, but the way she does it is no good. So we want to break that first, right? Get the plow through effect uh, uh, going more. Um, uh, Holding the one piece past contact point is the instruction that will give her a hold or don't break, allow the one piece to break at all. Keep the arm straight. Or the, the best instruction I gave her was um, make the one piece straighter after contact. And that seemed to help it um, um, work a little bit better. Uh, it didn't work anything on her on her uh, um, backhand, on her serve. Uh, show me the serve. The biggest thing is you got to make a big T. Go, make a big T. Big, 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 big T. Yeah, she doesn't like to make the big T. And um, keep the knee bend have a knee bend bend i don't want her jumping right now because if she jumps at the wrong time so we have to practice loading uh, at the correct time okay her directional control is, is is not so great i don't really care i don't care if the ball goes in right there i don't care where it goes right but when we went ahead and said i'm not going to say anything after we did all these corrections and i told her to hit down the line three in a row she was able to do it not much difficulty yeah so you you're getting it quick you're picking it up quick i think that's about it yes all right so next time we're going to work on her backhand we're going to continue to work live ball on her forehand side all right and we'll see you next time. All right, good job.